Okay, it's really sunny, but anyway, here's the car. I'm going to show the back damage first. It goes along with my story. Okay. It's dirty, so don't mind the dirt. Okay, I said something hit the back. All right. And that sun's so bright, I hope I can get all this. Okay, there's like literally scratches like right here. And I have them in a photo there too. I'll be sending. And there's scratches here. It's like there and there. And I would say those are like claw marks. And this, this part of the window. I hope I'm so sunny out here right now. This damage here, um, that happened that day. I mean, it's like literally into the gra uh, glass. You can't wash it off or scrape it off. So whatever smacked, it did there. And like claws here. And this car was pulled pulled down on the first uh, when I was reaching for the uh, tote bag. So I imagine that's from that. Okay. Later on, there's a crack in that windshield. I hope this is picking it up. Or, and I left the key in the car <laughs> in the house for this vehicle. But um, there is where the crack started. And, and it happened literally in the driveway. And it, this happened literally um, like a... A month later and maybe even up to two because I feel the stress from that heavy creature whatever it was demon on top of my roof it it made the crack okay and you can see you could see literally out all these windows uh, very well and had my street light right there you know so but I actually when I used I, I'm parking further back than I used to and yes you see across yes there's crosses I wear them I like I'm protecting myself any way I can really honestly and in the, in the night I absolutely will not go outside ever that don't happen all right I am so short to get dent damage I don't know if this is picking up anything or not because literally the sun's out and, and I can't see but there is literally Dents all down through here I can see and and I if I walk around the back side there's an incline here I I literally can't get the dents on the top but I have photos of my son you know he took in the night and it looks like I can see some dents here a little bit but there's a, a lot more of it there and I don't know I don't know if we're seeing anything here but there is dents. I'm just right now. I'm short. I was looking for a step stool. Um, I would say that's it. So I I don't know. You know, something made these marks, and 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 to me, I mean, that was like a wide span. Whatever th this is, and the car at that time um, was recently uh, painted. So. I know mean, uh, there wasn't at the time no marks at all. It was like really, you know, shiny and clean, whatever. And uh, yeah, I would show you around. Them. There's a lot of wooded area, and down there at the end of the driveway, uh, across the road, there's a mailbox past, you know, there's bushes and stuff. And yes, I haven't been able to trim up stuff lately, so stuff's a bit of a mess here. But down that road. Uh, just not in the woods and stuff on each side. It's it's creepy here at night. Yeah, but somewhere over in this neighborhood here is where um, that witch uh, had lived on this side of the road. And in the description uh, to old Mulderry, um, she she lived here, and this is where it was explained, you know, to be. But anyway, I've seen my boyfriend. He's over three hundred pounds. I. I literally uh, have, he can get in this vehicle. It don't push down on the shocks at all, even when he gets in. And I feel that, okay, whatever that is. Whatever was on that roof was extremely big, extremely heavy. And uh, it's just terrifying here at night. But I, I am really terrified to walk from, uh, I make sure I'm home by dark. Let's just put it that way, before dark. All right, now that's all I got. But here's that crack from here, so yeah. And this is from here. I mean, just in my driveway. I don't know what the heck's going on. Yeah. All right.
creepy. I'll start this. 